Okay, yeah, what's up everybody? Trust you guys are doing good out there. So welcome back to another beautiful episode today, okay? So today we want to talk about what we call uh, EFL and PL. Okay, you know, we have PFL and there is another one called EFL, right? Uh, is one of the major functions we have to send to headset. It's very perfect when you want to monitor sound, okay? So for example, let's say in the program now, uh, you know, instrument can be funny sometimes. So instead of you doing test run with the output that will stop people, you don't have to tamper with that. You can only monitor at your hand when you are done. Then you send it out to the main output, okay? So let's look at how to go about that, okay? It's very simple. Remember, I've explained the PFL. And for some of you that you're just coming, check the, the playlist. You will see access to that particular video. But if you just come, no problem anyway. Let's go. Okay. So this place, you have to plug your headset here. As you can see, this is monitor phone. So if you plug your headset here, you will be able to, um, you'll be able to set the exact volume you want here. Okay. I can check from my side, but you know, there is no way you hear me. But just follow this process. You understand. Okay. Your monitor phone. Okay. Just plug in your headset here or your earpiece, whichever one you have and regulate your volume. Don't damage your hair but okay so you come to this place for example you can see the pop there it will tell you whether the signal you are sending is afl or pfl okay let's test run now for example if i tap this place this is my pfl button you can see a red light is showing here instantly if i tap it back it will switch off so for example this is my audio that is playing let me switch it off okay if i tap here now let's say i want to monitor to horn red light then to send the signal here so in case maybe my volume is too loud or too low or maybe i'm playing the wrong song i can hear it through this headphone before sending to the main output do you understand me not right now okay if i switch it off then no signal will be coming here i will only be hearing what is going through the general mix okay but if i tap it again to go to my headset now i'll be able to hear that particular line alone so even though when the main program is going she will not tamper with anything she'll be able to hear what is going on then when you are ready then you switch it on to send it to everybody okay so that is how to use that of pfl okay now so if you're on this side i have here is my is the control for my return you know i have my return here I can set the pan level of each one of them. I've explained pan. If you don't know how to use pan by now, check the description. I have attached how to use pan. And also, before I forget, I have a free gift for you. Check the description of this video. I have a detailed ebook that will guide you on how to do live mixing. So, check it. It's free, it's free of charge, okay? Just check my description, download it, and read and practice. If you have any question, drop it in the comment section. And also, I have a detailed course on live sound mixing, okay? it's not free anyway it's just about a very little token it's just around 20 bucks okay just check it out and if you really like it no problem go for it it will help you I have like 20 plus video that will guide you on it okay so i've explained the pfl let's go back to the aflfl okay the pfl will understand that once we tap it it will send signal here if i switch it off you can see it's on now if i switch it off it will go if i tap this so maybe i want to monitor like two lines i can easily tap all of them i must just see the sign here okay now for the afl now remember this my side here is controlling my auxiliary and for the auxiliary you know you have the individual control here for each of your auxiliaries okay so you let's say okay currently i'm using auxiliary 5 for this my audio okay you can hear it now the level is high okay so that one is coming through my auxiliary 5 output but if i want to monitor it you know you have to just plug it here drop it there then activate this then i will be able to hear so likewise for this line this is auxiliary 5 just tap on it you know remember it's afl under this group section uh we have afl there and that is auxiliary so just tap on it watch this side you see to activate do you see it activate so i mean decide not to monitor what is going through my stereo mix using pfl i may want to check my auxiliary section so all i have to use is my efl now you understand the meaning of the here now it stands for auxiliary 
so that is auxiliary feedback level okay